I don't think we should dally here. Hey, I gotta... I gotta thank you for saving my hide today. There was that guy, and he was all... And I was... But then I got hit by an arrow. And then I fell over, and it was... Meep! But you were there, and you were all raw! <laughs> Spectaculous! I'm gonna drink to you, Commander. Here's to the... Here's to the... <laughs> Need something pummeled? Just say the word. Commander, the Lords of Amaranthine have come to swear fealty to you and the Grey Wardens. These were our Rendon House vassals. Now they will be yours. Lieges and vassals are seldom of one mind, Commander. Some of these lords bore Rendon no love, but others had their prospects ruined with his demise. Tread carefully, Commander. Lords and ladies, I present the Warden Commander of Ferelden and Arl of Amaranthine. Commander. Ban Esmeral of Amaranthine, as is old custom, you have the honor of beginning. I promise that I, Ban Esmeral, will be faithful to the Arl in matters of life, limb, and earthly honor. Never will I bear arms against her or her heirs. So I say, in the sight of the Maker. I promise that I, Lord Edelbreck... And so the ceremony is complete. Long live the Warden Commander! Let me know if you want the nobles cleared out. Ah, if you want the ceremony to end, I mean. There's really only two who can offer real support in the war. Lord Edelbreck, master of the Firavel Plains, controls more farmland than anyone else. He's powerful and popular. Van Esmeral rules the city. Wealthiest in the room by far. She may not be loved, but she cannot be ignored. A pleasure to meet you, Commander. Honored to meet you, Warden Commander. You come to us during desperate times. Not more about your precious farms, Edelbreck. Some in our Arling do not have the comfort of city walls. On the plains, the situation is dire. So you remember me, young Kuzland, although you're not so young anymore. I swear to you and Andraste, I had no part in Howe's treachery. My concern isn't that, however. As we feast, the peasants on our lands are starving, or worse. The city's defenses are more important, Edelbreck. There may be wheat in the silos now, but if the farmers die, where will you get your food? Thank you, my liege. I see that Lord Edelbreck wastes no time in canvassing you for soldiers to defend his farms. Do not be deceived, Commander. His livelihood is all he cares about. 
Amaranthin is the jewel of the Arling, and she must be protected. Pragmatism. A farming hovel can be rebuilt with straw and mud. Amaranthine was built over generations. If she falls, then this great Arling will be diminished. Wealth is well and good, but what measure do you put to human life? The folk in the country outnumber your city dwellers many times over. I would not be so vulgar as to violate the decorum of this event. Commander. Warden Commander, we've all heard so much about you. So many good things, unbelievable things. But many of your deeds cost people here a chance at great advancement. So many fortunes were deeply intertwined with the old Arl. Some nobles here, they seek to end your dominion over them. Perhaps you do not know the full extent of their determination. I've had occasion to intercept some of their missives. They are cryptic things. Any individual message is unintelligible, but together they form a pattern. They mean to end you before you can begin. A deadly coalition. I would take this matter seriously, Warden. They know of your capabilities and they're spending a fortune to see their aims fulfilled. Given a few days, I can retrieve the messages. I would have brought them tonight, but I didn't know if warning you would be wise. I've much to lose and precious little to gain. Farewell. We will meet again soon. It's an honor to have you as our liege, Commander. Villages come and go, but a city that has been sacked can take generations to recover. Commander. Let me know if you want the nobles cleared out. Ah, uh, if you want the ceremony to end, I mean. Edelbrecht speaks truly, sir, but things are dire. He and Ban Esmeral both contest the deployment of soldiers. But we don't have enough men. It's a matter of what you want to protect. The city, the land, trade.
As you wish. Let me know if you want the nobles cleared out. Ah, if you want the ceremony to end, I mean. Do you know the conspirators? The right of high justice is yours, and treachery is a capital offense. Better to be a touch paranoid than turning up face down in a ditch. To proceed, we'd need strong proof, and that'll be hard to gather. There are options, some I would not recommend. They could turn the nobles fierce. We could have some soldiers try to spy on the nobility. I suppose that might bear fruit. There are also rumors of someone called the Dark Wolf, who finds information for a fee. Dangerous fellow, by all accounts. Sort of an infamous figure. Caused a load of trouble to nobles in Denerim. They say he fled to the foreign quarter in Amaranthine to escape royal justice. Not bleeding likely, in truth. Good men. Lousy spies. You could invite a member of each of the noble families to stay as prolonged guests. And if anything untowards happens, well, you get the picture. This is a terribly Orlesian thing to do. You need to head to the city, then, and chase down a ghost. Let me know if you want the nobles cleared out. Ah, if you want the ceremony to end, I mean. As you wish, Commander. Clear the hall. The Commander has business to attend to. Yes. Talk about me stinking up the joint. What are you on about now? Cat piss. Little kitty there makes me want to vomit. Don't listen to him, Sir Pouncelot. You smell just fine.
Not to belabor the point or anything, but I think this caravan was attacked. Be careful. I'll show you why ladies are fierce! Trees are pretty. Tra la la. Just that. I'll get on it. I'll get you a ladder. You can get off my back. I see a trap. I see a trap. Got it.
I see a trap. Out of my way! I need to get out of here! No! No one can help me! I just need to get out of here! Nothing! We heard about the caravan attacks, but it wasn't us, I swear. We just thought there would be valuables left behind, but then... Make her help me! She's here! Gotta get away. Another scavenger here to prey on the misfortunes of others? No, you are too well armed. Here for me, then. You will not drive me from these forests. The Shems could not do it, the Darkspawn could not, and you will fare no better. Oh, you're here to battle the Darkspawn, then. Fair enough. Should you encounter any merchant caravans, tell them to release my sister or more of their men will die. Now go, deal with your Darkspawn, and stay out of my way. Consider this a warning. There's something out there. Oh, look. Look, more trees. What a shock. 